Hi, welcome back to Taronga TV. I'm with Beck. She's a backyard de bush keeper here at Taronga. And we're with someone very special, an Australian icon. This is Widgie. Tell us about Widgie. Widgie is an emu. So a lot of people aren't quite sure when they walk in here to backyard de bush what he is. But he's an emu, a very large bird, as you can see. And a lot of people's favourite around the zoo. He's quite a character. So they're related to ostriches and cassowaries and rheas. The second largest bird in the world, yes? Yes, yep, they're a ratite, so they're a flightless bird. Um, hopefully you'll be able to see his little wing That's just really under there. interesting, that is really interesting. Come and have a look at that folks, right underneath there. That little wing hanging down back, correct? Yeah, that's right. They look like little chicken wings next to his big long legs. Little remnants of where the wings were. Yeah, so he can't use them for anything. He will preen them, but otherwise yeah. he just walks with these beautiful long legs. And he walks wherever he likes. <laughs> <laughs> Off like that, whenever he wants as well. Will he come back? Yes, he will. Of course he will. We've got broccoli for him. Now there's another really interesting fact that I don't think people would know, Beck, about reproduction. Could you talk us through that? Yeah, so emus, the females lay clutches of eggs in breeding season, which is around November to March, and then the males will actually sit on the eggs. So Widgie here goes into that same process, even though he lives here without a female. Every year at this time of year, he goes into breeding season. So he fluffs up his feathers. He does a lot of drumming, so loud vocalizations. And he likes to follow people around in this area. And once he starts going into that process and he sort of stops wanting to eat his food, which is a natural process they go through, the keepers will actually offer him eggs. So not real eggs, but luckily the bird show team will make us some fake eggs that are like emu eggs. And we offer them to Widgie around some leaves and when he's ready he'll actually make a nest and he'll draw the eggs into his nest. So Widgie's made his way off. Fantastic bit of information. Thank you Beck. It's always great to pick up those tiny little bits of information about weird and wonderful Australian animals like Widgie. Emus are incredible. Thanks very much for watching. We'll see you next time on Taronga TV. Thanks Beck. Thank you.